hi mamas welcome back to my channel and everyone else who is watching you being here obviously means that your baby is having a difficult time passing stools right so i just want to quickly share with you the things that i got to do when my baby was having difficulties passing um stools so yeah let me just get right into it because that baby gotta poop so the first one is a green bar suppository so what i did is that i cut a piece a little piece of sunlight bar of a green bar into this shape and then i don't worry don't worry about how big the shape is if it's gonna fit in your little ones um bam bam it's gonna fit i cut i cut it this size because it's still gonna melt it's still melting here and then when it melts so the reason why i put it in this water is so that it can be soft for me to mold it in the shape that is supposed to go up up top right so i'm just gonna let this one um, melt a little bit more you know soften up a little bit more and um i'm gonna move on to laxan listen this this Another thing that I would like to talk about real quick before introducing a med to my baby it started with her cramps you know she had like colic she would struggle with wind on her stomach and then uh, I had people saying that babies are not supposed to take meds a baby is not supposed to take well doctors were like don't give your child anything how do I look at my little baby like cramping day all night all day crying knowing that there are meds there are some over-the-counter meds that can actually help her so yeah that is also one other thing that made uh, things a little bit difficult for me when it came to uh choice of meds and all that so laxin is as it's a laxative it's a laxative so if your baby is constipated or whatever just give her like just give her this just give her this it's uh, even babies can take it because they say here under one year the initial dose is like five milliliters daily and that's if he or she is constipated and another thing is that be sure that your baby really is constipated before you use any of these things you know signs of constipation could be um he or she is trying so hard to push out poop and nothing is coming out you know they're cranky they're crying yeah, you know all of those things all the signs and then they are farting a lot <laughs> I can used to fart a lot <laughs> she used to fart a lot and she would literally like try and push out poop and nothing was coming out like the whole day day and night or when so yeah just make sure that you really 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 are sure that your baby is um constipated and then now I think we're gonna go to my sunlight I think it's soft enough so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do this so i'm molding it in a bullet like shape you know so just keep molding 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 and if you feel like it's still um a little bit hard put it back in the water ne? put it back in the water you know sculpt it and all that until it is in a form of a bullet because we want it to be smooth wanted to just go so what happens with this is that when you put it in the the baby tries and pushes it out baby tries and pushes this out and then when it comes out poop comes out and another thing that i would stress is that don't depend on these you know this is to use when you feel like my baby hasn't pooped for the longest time also don't mind my nails guys it's life it happens my baby hasn't pooped for like you know for days and maybe you see that he or she is struggling that is when you can use these two if you use it all the time the baby might depend on it you know for to poop and also he or she might associate pooping with with these struggles <laughs> especially this one because at the end there's a point where when i was putting these she knew it's okay it's about to go down and she would cry oh and also um please don't use both methods so it's either one or the other don't give baby a laxative and then do this because no no we we, we can't do that to our little ones this nature and also do try and make it as smooth as possible before you insert it in the important part is this part okay 
okay where are you so what you do afterwards is that you lay your baby <laughs> on her okay at the hand you lay your baby on his or her back ne? and then put up his or her feet like you're wiping and then you just slide it in ne? you just slide it in you don't have to push it in in, in just the, it's just gonna disappear when it's going you know go in there and then you'll see five minutes five minutes is a lot the baby will start cooking immediately so i hope this video was helpful don't forget to subscribe and uh, become part of this family let's help each other let's grow together let's raise our children together and um yeah i will see you on my next video ciao